And Agriculture Secretary William Dar announced that the Duterte administration would adapt non-tariff measures as well as a land use plan to improve the local agriculture sector. These include subsidies that would help Filipino farmers to be globally competitive and have the capability to export their goods. He also appealed to the top 27 rice-producing provinces in the country to help small rice farmers cope with the plummeting price of palay. Isabella has been buying palay directly from farmers and sell it directly in their province and in some metro Manila cities. Likewise, Neva Ecija allotted 200 million pesos to also directly buy palay and sell the majority to Metro Manila. Ilocos Norte, meanwhile, agreed to begin engaging directly in the rice industry value chain to benefit farmers and consumers.